My name is Sean Bechu, and I play Wrench in Watch Dogs 2 and Watch Dogs Legion. I can identify with Wrench. He's a lovable misfit. Wrench is so organically tied to who I am. He's part of my soul. When I see memorabilia of characters I've played, it's very surreal. I played Miles Upshur in Outlast, Blake Langerman in Outlast 2, Lion in Rainbow Six. I've been in nine of the 12 Assassin's Creed games, and I play Wrench in the Watch Dogs series. Well, I'd say Wrench is definitely one of the defining performances of my career. I think one of the reasons why um, I connect to him so much is he's basically me. <laughs> he's such a great guy. I love you, Wrench. I love you too, Sean. <laughs> Watch Dogs Legion takes place several years after Watch Dogs 2, so Wrench is older, he's wiser, he's a different person now, but I think all the things people connect to are still there. I absolutely connect to Wrench as a character, not only in terms of personality, but in terms of his relationship to anxiety and depression. I mean, I was bullied as a kid. I thought Wrench was a good way of expressing my relationship to those things. Playing characters whose faces are hidden is challenging because actors rely heavily on their face and their eyes to convey emotion and intention. My way of overcoming the limitations of not being able to use my face was to make more interesting and bigger physical choices. The way I got involved with the first Watch Dogs game, I was brought in to play uh, a whole bunch of minor characters, vendors, cops, soldiers, civilians. That involvement eventually led me to getting work in Watch Dogs 2 as well. Time to get into character. I got this amazing costume uh, tailor-made for me by uh, one of my friends on Twitter. The mask was made by another fan of mine. All right. Time to get my wrench on. Wrench, his personality is a little lot like me. I have a better sense of reading the room and maybe not pissing off people quite so much. Wrench doesn't care uh, about upsetting authority. Time for some gaming. Let's kick some butt. Totally Game has set me up with a special Watch Dogs Legion challenge, but I'm gonna warm up first by playing some Watch Dogs 2 with my good friend, Medea. I played Watch Dogs 2 and absolutely loved Wrench's character. So I tweeted to him and told him he did an awesome job as Wrench. Games have done a really, really big deal for me. Like they've had a huge impact on my life. Um, they've saved me from a really, really dark place. Oh, here we go. I got him, I got him. I found the stairs! I win! That was super awesome, Sean, as always. Thank you so much. And now it's time to play Watch Dogs Legion for the very first time. Seeing as how Wrench is returning for this game, it's only fair that I see firsthand just what I'm getting myself into. Already I can tell that the graphics are way better. Hi, right, what do we got here? A man on a boat. Looks sinister. Wow, these graphics are solid. Oh, Whoa, that was a spinning jump kick. Very nice. My kind of guy. Boom! Oh, beautiful. Oh, headshot. The graphics, the, the, the processing speed. It's just a really nice evolution of the genre. Oh, so much for cover. Jesus. It's pretty tense. I love it. I think I'm under 15 minutes. Oh, that's another explosion. That's a third explosion. That doesn't sound good. Oh! I guess I won't be playing as him again. I think that challenge was meant to fail. We've been set up. Well... That was awesome. I cannot wait to play through this game as Wrench. I want to tell stories. I want to entertain people. I want to connect with people. If my performance or my characterization can uplift someone or help them out of a tough spot or inspire them, that's really, I think, the greatest reward I can get as an actor. 